Hello, uh, Mr. Frosty here, and today I'm going to show you guys how to get these free Ultimate Legend Elite Packs right here, or whoever you want basically. I'm going to show you guys how to get them for free and how it's so simple to do. So before we start off this video, I've noticed that a couple of my subscribers I don't watch my videos. Uh, if you guys are subscribed, go ahead and click the bell, man. Click that notification bell so you guys are notified whenever I post. And if you guys are new, go ahead and like and subscribe. Let's try to get this video up to 25 likes like always. And yeah, let's get right into it. So as you guys know, there's two different types of live events. This one right here, the ones on the top is uh, Ultimate Legend Badge Blitz. And then the one on the bottom is Emblem Blitz. So these are actually going to help you to get the diamond right here. So if you guys are trying to reach for the diamond, basically, you're going to go ahead and need to grind that, obviously. But... If you grind these right here, you have a chance to get an actual a Legend Elite player. And with that Legend Elite player, you can go ahead and exchange that for um, some Elite trophies right here. So let me go ahead and show you guys what I mean. So by doing the live events, I have pulled uh, these right here. Oh, you can't see them. So you can only see them if you exchange them. You can't, they're not auctionable. But I've pulled these Elites right here, or these Legends right here. So I got two free Legends. You know, actually three. So I got three free legends just from grinding the ultimate legend uh, events right here. It doesn't matter which one, you know, you're gonna get, you're gonna be, um, you're gonna at least get one of them depending on how much you grind. So if you grind 20 or like 25, I'm pretty sure you get at least one. So right here, as you guys can see, we have five elite trophies for free without spending any coins, without doing any of that. And it's pretty good, you know, these are not auctionable anyway. So whatever is not auctionable, obviously you want to exchange for these elite trophies. So yeah. So I went ahead and actually got a few packs on my bench here so I can show you guys the odds of it. So let me go ahead and select all and unselect these quad packs here. Is all of them? Okay. Uh, yeah. All right, so it looks good. So we're going to go ahead and open up 25 of these Ultimate Legend Event Blitz packs right here, I guess. These are the emblem ones first. So whenever you see like, like two cards or whatever, then that means you got an Elite. So hopefully we can get an elite right here. Um, yeah, you always want to hope for actually like, if you get like an 84 above, I mean, excuse me, 85 and above, then you know, you lucked out because that's two elite trophies. If you get an 85 plus, if you get an 84, then that's just one. But I mean, it's free. Like I said, you need eight of them to complete a ultimate legend elite. So this is really going to help you out to do that. It's pretty good, man. Pretty good. So honestly, I, I didn't even know you can actually do that, like pull a legend from these, but I was grinding yesterday and I got three of the legends, man, yesterday and I was like, what? I was shocked. Honestly, I was really shocked. All right. <clears throat> Sorry about that. Let's continue with this here. So we open up 11 packs so far. Uh, oh, this is the 11th pack. Okay, so let's continue. We still have about 13 left. So no, no luck right here. Just a bunch of 20 pluses or plus 20, excuse me. That's still pretty good. You always want the 24s, obviously, from these packs. Oh, right there! We, wow! No way! We get a Diamond Steve Smith! Yo! What the heck, bro? That reaction was boo-boo, but dang! We get a Diamond player from that event, dude. Oh, my gosh. Oh, actually, you know what? This one's auctionable. So, this one is auctionable. Okay, so... So the, I guess the diamonds are auctionable, I'm assuming. So right there, that 92 overall is auctionable. So that's actually going to help you out uh, drastically. That's going to help you out a lot, actually. Because most likely, you're going to be able to get two um, oh, Ultimate Legends from that, actually. So let's uh, continue here. All right, so bam. So we still got, uh, what, 19? So we got that one in our 17th pack, I think, or 16th, right? So like I said, you're, you're bound to get at least one out of, out of 20 of these packs, bro. You're bound to get at least one. As you guys can see, I pulled one within 20, so it kind of makes sense. You know, but you know, I have to get, like, I'm, not, I'm not sure if it's going to be a diamond, though. That's the thing. So if you get a diamond, that's pure luck, because I got pure lucky right there, man. Pure luck. Absolutely lucky getting that diamond pull from that. All right, so let's continue here. And the final pack, finally. And we get no elite, so that's fine. So we did end up getting a diamond here. All right, guys, so for the diamond player, if you guys ever get a diamond player like this, go ahead and exchange it. I would recommend you exchange it, honestly, because 
we're in the set if you guys take a look right here at the set let's go back to the sets really quick so if you guys take a look at the set right here it says uh oh not that one but the one right here as you guys can see there's a set right here where it says requirements and it only takes one diamond trophy and if you get that if you put in that diamond trophy you get a random ultimate legend elite player i believe is it select or random yeah it's a random so you get one random um elite player it doesn't matter who it is honestly if it's random it don't matter because you know they're all the same you're, you're gonna exchange them anyway so it doesn't matter who you get but yeah so instead of getting 40 golds right here and eight elite trophies all you can do is just get one diamond trophy and then bam son right there easy all right so that's just one way to get the elite trophies right now so another way to get elite trophies is by getting these combine elite players right here so this one also gives you a chance at a diamond if you do pull a diamond from this like i said go ahead and exchange it it's better if you exchange a diamond instead of doing all this hassle to get 40 golds and eight elites so i'd rather you exchange it so right now this set is actually pretty easy to do uh so far i've been able to complete this set three times a day so that's a lot of elites and a lot of chances of diamonds here but yeah so right now i'm not gonna do it because i'm trying to get to jamie collins right here i just need the, the tokens that's it but yeah so that's another way you guys can get those elite trophies is from this set right here all right so the quad hub is gonna be your gold maker right here so the quad hub is also gonna give you a bunch of golds it's probably the only way you guys can get golds for free so quad hub is gonna be your friend big time because you have a chance at elites and you have a chance at golds um what what, what i mean by elites is right here this set so if you guys complete this a thousand mics and get 75 of those football emblems or badges whatever then you have a chance or you don't have a chance but you do get an elite player from this so just by grinding, you can easily get one elite player from this. Easy, man. Easy. Like I said, just do your events every day. You have 24 events every day. So, you know, it's not bad. You get 24 packs. You have a chance to get golds. And I'm pretty sure, like, in probably three days or, like, uh, what, like three days or four days, you can go ahead and get 40 gold uh, players right here. I'm pretty sure it's possible like that. So, yeah. So, also, if you guys do get silvers from that um quad hub thing because i know that quad hub gives you a lot of silvers so if you guys end up getting a lot of silvers not to worry because with those silvers you can exchange those for golds uh let me just go ahead and show you guys what i mean right here so if you guys go to the store and go to the trophies go to trading right here as you guys can see you guys can trade in 10 silver trophies for a gold player so i'm not sure if it's a i think it's a random gold player right yeah, so you guys are trying to aim for the 75 plus overall. So hopefully you guys can do that here and get those 75 pluses because those gave you two gold trophies instead of one. So yeah, so if you guys get silvers, like I said, easy. Just put them in the trading right here and you guys can get an easy gold. All right, so for the quad hub, I do have seven packs right here. So we're going to go ahead and open those and see if we can get an elite. You can actually pull an elite from the packs as well. So from just doing the live event packs, you, got, you can actually pull an elite from that. So the way you know you have an elite is if you get four i'm pretty sure because last time i got an elite it was four instead of three packs or three yeah three players excuse me there was only five there's four so right here we get silvers like i said don't be worried if you get silvers man this is your for sure uh gold method right here so right there bam look at that we get a gold with just the third pack so it's you know it's like i said it's pretty simple to get golds here so we get a, another uh silver there and well, another thing you can do too if you guys get the free elite from this you can go ahead and sell that and then buy some gold yourself i'm pretty sure the elites from here go for like what like 30k or below at least the average or excuse me not, not 30k below but 30k and above so i think 30k is the lowest these uh these uh what you call it quad hub elites go for it's like rising stars veterans all that good stuff so we get another gold right there so that's not bad so I think we got like three golds from that or like two golds, but I know we got two for sure. So I think that was three golds. So imagine getting three golds in what, like four days. It's like 12. I know, I know you need 40, but you know, using those silver players, you can go ahead and exchange those for gold players. Like I said, that's going to be your friend because you're going to get a lot of silvers from this dude. A lot of silvers, man. Uh, so I think that's about it for gold players. Um, I don't think there's any other way to get golds besides doing like what like leagues and stuff like that probably overdrive can give you some golds too maybe uh i'm not really too positive on that let me just claim this real quick yeah so hopefully you guys did enjoy this video um yeah let me know what you guys think about this below 
let me know if it helps you guys out if you guys have any like tips or anything any methods i missed or something like that then let me know in the comments below and um yeah